Hey gang, what we're now going to do is we're going to take a look at the idea of complex trusts, simple trusts, what are the requirements, what can you do, what can't you do, how do you distribute things, etc. We've got some great illustrations to refresh your memory before we try some of the more challenging exercises. So let's study this one together. Let's start out and discuss something here. Whether a trust is a simple trust or a complex trust affects the taxation of the trust as well as the taxation that will occur to the beneficiaries. A trust is a simple trust if it's required to distribute all its income currently and it cannot make a charitable contribution and does not make distributions from principle. If a trust is not a simple trust, in other words, any violation, it's then a complex trust. Assume for the next four scenarios that you are preparing the tax return for the trust discussed and must determine the type of trust it is. Let's take a look at the first one here. The Accountants Are Awesome Trust is considered a simple trust because it is required to distribute all income currently, it cannot make a charitable contribution, and doesn't distribute principal. If it were to make a distribution in excess of the income, then it would be considered a complex trust. But in this case, it's a simple trust. Our second example. Our second example is the Tax Is Terrific Trust is a complex trust because it makes distributions out of principal, violating the rules and requirements for a simple trust. The trust accounts for income is 35000 while its distributions were more than that, they were 40000 Thus, it distributed 5000 of principal. Hence, we're going to click it off as a complex trust. In our third scenario, an auditor's are amazing trust is a complex trust because it has charitable organizations as the beneficiary violating a requirement of a simple trust. Notice, it's giving away things to charity. In scenario four, the Sassy Systems Trust will be a complex trust in the year of termination because even if it was a simple trust, in the year of termination, it distributes all its principal. And when you distribute principal, you're not a simple trust. You're a complex trust. The trust may have been a simple trust in previous years, but a simple trust is treated as complex in the year it terminates because corpus, principal, is being distributed. So therefore, we move it down and say it's a complex trust. 